All right, first vlog with a new camera. Let's see how it goes. Um, there's no screen on the front. Um, I know if you guys watch Max Tuning or Nick Wright's channel, they have the 7D, 7D, like the number is 70, and then D, I have the 7D. So um, it's more durable, actually a higher quality, higher gray camera, but um, there's no screen that kind of comes out. So um, especially here at the beginning, Please stay with me, and because um, I don't know where I am, uh, screen-wise, focus-wise, or anything-wise. So, um, but I want to show you guys a quick trick, real um, kind of quick. Uh, my grandma taught me. So shout out to grandma, because I know she watches the channel. Um, I had to dress, kind of dress up today. Um, not wearing any pants. I don't know if you guys saw that, <laughs> but um, we're doing a uh, experiment on the baseball team. Um, kind of formulating a sports beverage, so um, kind of helping some friends out there. But I had to bring the khaki shorts out of retirement um, from the winter, so I'm um, just kind of show you guys um, a quick trick that my grandma taught me. So, all right, so um, off, obviously pretty wrinkly. Um, so put ice cubes and kind of a towel in there with it. And yeah, tumble dry on medium or low, and that'll actually steam it for you so you don't have to iron it because I will not iron anything. Hope that tip helps. Okay, so I got a, uh, a request from a subscriber, and Shane actually, so shout out to Shane. But he said, Do more days of eating. Now, my take on days of eating, yes, they are helpful for you. Um, from the standpoint of me, I don't really change what I eat. So um, that actually, I mean, from the standpoint of you guys as well, because I mean, what you guys see really in the first one, that's basically what I eat every time. But I want to start incorporating more food and nutrition aspects into the into the videos. Um, I can't say I'm going to do, you know, a hundred editions of days of eating. I really can't tell you that because I don't know if I can make that make that uh, commitment. But um, I'll show you guys what I'm having for breakfast this morning before I head to uh, class. So, yeah. All right, so um, just some egg beaters. The Southwestern style has a little spice to it, so that's good. Um, just potatoes, so egg and potatoes. And then we're gonna top that with um, some fat-free cheddar. And also some garlic salt that got dismantled by heat. So, yeah. And then, uh, I'm gonna have an apple, and that's. I'm gonna have an apple um, without not ketchup. <laughs> I'm gonna have the ketchup on that stuff right there. But yeah, and then the apple. So that's gonna be my breakfast. I'll show you guys the finished product when it is done. All right, quick tip for you guys who uh, cook a lot of uh, egg beaters and egg whites, um, like I do, um, add a lid. I didn't always add a lid, and it just overall obviously traps the heat and cooks faster, and also allows it to cook more, f uh, I guess, fuller, you know, more through um, on top, so you're not having to constantly flip it or do whatever. So, um, yeah, try a lid out. All right, I guess this is turning into a breakfast tip video, but um, what I do with my potatoes, instead of just microwaving them, that's boring, I like to cut them up and put them in a pan. It kind of gives them more of like a breakfast potato look. Um, well, not, I guess, look too, but and taste. So um, I'll slap that on there with some, I can't believe it's not butter, and garlic salt. And then oops, pop the lid on there and let those cook while my cheese melts. One serving of cheese. And coming up is the full meal. All right, here's the finished meal, finished breakfast. 
Um, I do love ketchup. You guys will know that. You guys will learn that. And also, if you're looking for exquisite um, food display, this isn't the channel for you because I don't care about that because I'm going to eat it anyways. But that's the breakfast. Pretty simple. I'm going to take my vitamins. If you guys are looking for a good vitamin, um, Optimal Nutrition has a great one. Um, it's got a great profile. Um, a lot of stuff in it. I am not huge on um, buying a lot of different things, so all-in-one is good for me. I'm also bad about taking it, so if it's all-in-one, that's good for me. And then Quest Bar for good luck. So macros will be on screen somewhere, hopefully with a cool sound effect. All right, so I guess this video turned into a day in the life. So there you go, there's that. Um, but we're headed out to campus, headed out to campus now. And uh, we got our, we had a big breakfast, as you guys noticed, but the big breakfast was because I don't know when the next time I'll get to eat is. So I wanted to supply my body with the nutrients that it needed um, to kind of keep me running through the day. So that and I have my caffeine pill on deck. So. Uh, yeah, headed out to campus and uh, we'll touch base when we touch base. I don't know when that'll be. So, see you when I see you. 99.5 WKDQ. I'm also. Alright, guys, we're back from campus and the experiment went really, really good. Um, we are going to eat our pre workout meal and then we are going to do something on the computer then hit up, hit up the gym for a uh, good old chest day on Thursday, so. Um, let me show you what I'm eating. Um, I'm gonna do uh, some chicken breasts that I cooked up yesterday. So we're gonna go ahead and weigh, weigh that out here. And yes, I just grabbed it with my hands. Get over it. Whatever. All right, so, sounds pretty good about seven ounces of chicken and we're gonna do some of these uh, golden potatoes and I'll show you guys my good old pantry here we got oh the pop tarts and we're gonna do a package of pop tarts as well so um, and maybe a fiber one too I don't know ah. package of pop tarts um, it's the low fat ones too uh, we might fat gets lowered, I tend to eat a lot more of these low-fat ones. And then I'm probably going to have a fiber one bar, but I don't know. Keep you updated. Maybe, if, I don't know where my carbs are at, so let me check that, and then I'll check back in. Alright guys, here's the meal. Uh, we have 7 ounces of chicken, 200 grams of potatoes, which isn't that much, but that was what was left, and a package of pop tarts. And I also added, if you guys can see, I told you guys I love ketchup. I'm not joking. Um, there's some sausage in there somewhere. Kind of right there. Um, that sausage is actually... Um, ah, this morning star. Um, it's not actually meat. I think it's veggie sausage. But anyways, the macros are really, really good. Somewhere. I am a moron. Wow. Focus. Please. I'm still learning the camera. Not sure what it focuses on or what it doesn't focus on. Focus! Oh my god. Alright, anyways, three grams of fat, um, three grams of carbs, and ten grams of protein. Um, so, real good macros there. And if you guys just saw what I did, I spilled them everywhere. Where's the other ones? There's one, there's one. Uh, there's one all the way over there. Oh my gosh. Look at that guy. He's just chilling. All right guys, I'm gonna eat. Um, I'm gonna eat and then probably edit up some video footage and then uh, for one, I'm gonna pick up this damn sausage off the ground. But then, we're mealing. See you in the next clip. Alright guys, I haven't really been updating you on my physique in general, so um, nine weeks out. Uh, so, I mean, I feel pretty good.
still very minimal cardio. Uh, two hit sessions a week. Um, sprints. I mean, I get after sprints, but I mean, still feeling full and everything's going good. Macros are still high. So almost about 400 carbs, 220 protein, 55 fat. So, um, you know, everything's going really good. So I'm feeling really good about that. Um, you know, overall, sorry, moving you around. Overall, I'm feeling really, really good. So, you know, I hope, uh, I hope everything I'm telling you guys or helping you out with, you know, I hope everything's really helping you out. And, you know, if you guys, if you guys really want to know something or kind of know what I'm doing or know why I'm doing something, you know, let me know in the comments below, please. And, uh, I'll be happy, happy, happy to answer it. So, um, we're off to the gym. I'm going to get changed. And, uh, this will end the day in the life video. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, comment below if you want to see something, but I'm taking you along, taking the new camera, wow, along with me to the gym. So, I'm excited to get some awesome footage for you guys. And, um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Campus Physique, wow. Campus Physique.